Today we're gonna have a quick chat about what British people are like and because of the season, you'll probably spend some time in an airport. And to get there, I use the metro. And when it's your stop to get off, because it's summer, you'll probably see a shirtless chav with a baseball cap on, jump a wrap round his waist with 95s on blasting some MC, who'll start pressing on the door's button before anyone can even see the station, just to let everyone know he's got this situation under control. But when you get inside the airport and go through the nothing to declare area, why do you suddenly start worrying? As if you forgot that you packed five kilos of cocaine and a headless chicken in your backpack. As you know, in airports, there's a lot of doors. And eventually, you're going to run out of ideas how to thank the person in front of you who keeps opening the doors for you. Cheers. Ta. Nice one. Now if you're a lad wearing anything from North Face to Nike Tech, you better hold tight vanilla ice because you're about to get randomly searched. But when you're home, as soon as it hits over 8 degrees, your mum's gonna pull out the foldy chairs, which she likes to call the posh chairs, where your whole family's going to sunbathe. And at the end of the day, your face will be as red as when the farmer catches you running through his field of wheat. Then the ice cream man would come. So you'd shout, Nana, can I have an ice cream? But my Nana would always tell me that when the ice cream man played his music, it meant he had no ice creams left. Then all the kids would be lining out outside the ice cream van. Nana, I seen all these nagas lining up outside the ice cream van, man. He's got, he's got no ice creams left, man. <laughs> And when you nip in to grab something, next thing you know, you hear the words which send a shiver down your spine. Right, you're either in or out now. And when you were inside in summer, your grandpa would always say, Aye, when I was your age, I was out playing having fun. Aye man, because you had black and white TVs. If I had one of them, I'd be outside climbing trees, trying to find a phone line to call child line. And who remembers when the Jehovah's used to knock at your door? And all of a sudden, your mum would turn into a ninja warrior and spear you over the couch. Nah, no, but everyone's buzzing in summer, aren't they? You could probably spit on your granny, and she'd probably respond, that's just the cool down I needed, pet. Cheers. So once again, if you had a little laugh at this video, feel free to share it. It means a lot. And aye, uh, in a bit. Oh, oh, oh my lord, oh my god, that girl, she trying to go. Yes.